Hi Pisces, welcome to your reading. Let's see past, present, future, what you need to know. Let's see Pisces, this is a general reading, so, uh, so please take only what resonates with your life, your um, situation. Don't force anything into your life. So, um, Pisces, I will pull for you three cards. Three cards for the past. Three cards for your present moment. And three cards for the future. Let's see your challenge. Your challenge is the Emperor in Reverse. Um, either you are dealing with someone here that is very stubborn, someone who is trying to control, to tell you what to do, how to do, or this might be you. Some things may not work the way you want at this time because of your attitude, the way you try to do things. If this, this stubborn person is you. Let's see what's the next. The devil... Yeah, there is this need of, of releasing something. It's just not working out. It will not help you. Um, if you have such a behavior or attitude, it won't help you. All right? It will just make things worse for you. Um, but Pisces, let's see. Let's see what happened here into your recent past. And we have... All right, so some of you here, maybe you decided in the past, you felt like the right thing to do is to, to plan a moving with someone or moving somewhere, going somewhere, doing something together with the person here, or just m you moving out from home, or you, you made a decision like something to change in your life here is just um, things did not work out the way you thought they will and I say this because you have the two of cups in reverse and this is imbalance this is disharmony this is a breakup a tension in between two people or more or you being you know um a little bit lost here because what you thought is the right thing to do turned out to be not that way and this happened for a reason we will see uh, with the next cards um, but let's start to clarify okay just a moment okay So in the past here, you try to make things work in a situation. Look at this. You made a decision. The justice card is there. You've been thinking, thinking, and you try to make something good here. So you decide, right? You took control and you said, let's do this. Let's do that, right? Let's... Let's dare to move in another place. Let's dare to do things in a certain way. But this, it may have been in the beginning okay, but then things start to turn against you or go wrong. Um, and I see that you've been trying your best here to, to you know, to fix it, to make the best out of the situation. It just did not work out. It's just did not work out. And did not work out, Pisces, because um, I see your strength. I see your confidence. You did not want to let go of something or someone here. You were like, I, we can do this. I can do this. Can be better. But 
it hasn't been that way because it wasn't supposed to be that way. In the present moment, well, you are kind of looking into the past, right? You are like, you wish to make peace with that person or to, I don't know, to reconcile with someone here. You wish to make things better back or be, uh, uh, good again, you know. Um, you have this desire maybe deep inside of you to someone to forgive you or you want to um, to like them to apologize to you you are going through a lot of thinking here you have the hermit card so you you are um quite looking into the past this i can say right now the present moment looks like because you have the ten of wands a lot of heaviness right you are dealing with a lot of things you are a little bit uh, overstressed here you are starting to fall under the weight of all these things that are happening to you right now okay so you kind of need to clear the way you need to to do something here to um to bring things back into balance because you cannot go on in this way all right it's just it's too much to deal with Okay, it's just too much to deal with. For some of you, <clears throat> so for some of you here, um, you need to. Um, to make peace with your life as it is right now, okay? You have the Nine of Pentacles. You might be all by yourself right now. Um, and you know what? It is enough. It's all what you need right now, okay? So don't look into the past. Don't try to, um, you know... Uh, because someone here is like, I, I feel like you are waiting, waiting like someone else to come back to your life or something like this. Be, um, be content with your life right now. You are single here for a reason. Okay. You have something to build up. You, you have things to, to take care of. Look at this devil again. Um, was here right yes the devil was here also so you need to to be focused on on what you do what you will do next with your life all right stop focusing into the past stop focusing on other people you should be focused on yourself and uh, your life I see here someone looking forward to communicate with another person. But this is a waste of time. Okay, this is a waste of time. You need, look at this, yes. You need to take care of yourself, to plan something here, to be a little bit strategic. You have things to figure it out in your own life. And um, if there is a person that is there on your mind... You need to to just, I know it's easy to say, hard to do, but um, you should love yourself enough to let go of that person. You know, it's very important. Or this situation might be a situation, not necessarily a person, something that you deal with in the past here. Let go of that stuff, thinking of it. Thinking of something that already took place is not going to change it. What is going to change is your present moment. And of course, your future will be affected by it. So looking into your future, in the next period of time, you will take your power back. And you will have this focus. As I said, the strength card is exactly about power, strength, control right you will be focused on you know making your life better what we have here four of cups 
yeah, you will take the time to, you know, analyze what is on your plate, how, what um, you need, what you don't need. You will take the time, okay? You will take the time. Then you have the Hermit card, which is all about soul searching, right? It's introspection, it's um, looking for the, the truth within yourself, um, looking or listening to that inner guidance. A lot of a lot of thinking here in the future but I it's like you are just going to do all this analyze uh, because um, you you want to make sure that you you are how to say you protect yourself right because the four of pentacles here with all these chains you want to make sure that uh, you you won't be hurt again or disappointed again right you just want to to protect yourself and that's normal and that's fine you should do that page of swords here shows me that you will um, you know you will you will communicate with someone okay you will communicate with someone and again nine of pentacles uh, maybe you are thinking of doing something on your own maybe a business i don't know something that will give you some sort of independency you don't want to depend on nobody in the future and you will be able to achieve this you will talk with someone someone will give you here um, some good piece of advice to keep to keep you away uh, from trouble and one thing that you need to take care of here is to get uh, get more organized you know organized in your mind in your office um, in your home things has to ha have their own place you know and you will learn this in the future you will learn this in the future to to be more um, organized and you will understand you will see the benefits of of arranging everything in in their in the right place all right either is in your mind either is in your home at work this discipline will bring a great change to your life you will see this Pisces you will see let's take two oracle cards for you in this moment what else you need to know even before i start your reading i was shuffling the cards and they were all over the place hard hard that's why uh, discipline is the word okay for you so you have the sunflower which is saying action so in order to to create a solid foundation in your life in order to go out of stagnation you need to take action in the best way possible you need to to be creative and you need to um <laughs> to listen to your heart you know and uh, to ask yourself first of all all right something came to an end right you need to put an end of something in order to start something new so you need to follow your heart and to do as what it feels right for you okay so whatever you want to achieve can be achieved when you have a clear uh, plan when you have um, a clear mind and when definitely you say no to procrastination when definitely you say no to depending on others and you choose yourself and you put all your strength all your power into getting things done all right so your focus should be on a goal here something that your heart truly wants and you will be able to to make this you will you will um 
you will become more uh, organized and also with the emperor here in reversed as your challenge was about you know this lack of discipline out of control but in the future here you will uh, stabilize your life and you will be able to step into a new phase flying free towards a new home a new job a new relationship towards the sun towards the true happiness we have also the sunflower here which she's looking right facing the, the sun and you are flying exactly towards the sun you are being guided to go somewhere else to where you will um, have a wish fulfillment so here is saying expecting miracles yes yes everything is possible Everything is possible, Pisces. That's definitely. Now your last... Okay. Oracle card is... Never give up. With patience you can reach your mountain top. Perseverance. Okay. So you have the personal choice. Close your eyes. What animal do you imagine? What strengths are they known for? What wisdom do they share? Embrace these qualities. Yes, Pisces. This is your reading. This is what I've got for you. I really hope you enjoyed this reading and it was helpful. If that's the case, if you resonated with it, please give a like. Let me know in the comments below. Um, take care of yourself. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done it yet, of course. Um, I see you very soon with a new reading. I wish you all the best and love and light.